Hey, I'm Thomas with Cadet Technical Support. I'm gonna show you how to upgrade your standard baseboard heater to our Cadet Soft Heat Baseboard. Before you do anything else, you'll want to turn off the breaker. First, unscrew the screw that holds the wiring compartment cover on and remove the cover. Disconnect the power wires that go to the heater. In our case, our wires are attached to wire nuts. Unscrew the green ground screw and remove the bare copper ground wire. Unscrew and remove the mounting screws that hold the heater to the wall. If your heater has a strain relief connector, go ahead and disconnect it now. Once you have removed the strain relief connector, carefully feed the wire back through the hole and now your heater is uninstalled. Now you're ready to install the soft heat heater. Pull up and pull out on the cover to remove it. You'll probably notice that the knockout holes on the new soft heat lines up with the wiring coming out of the wall. Now measure from the edge of the baseboard molding on the wall to the first and second stud that the baseboard was mounted to. Now transfer these measurements onto the soft heat. Use a center punch to mark where you will drill the mounting holes on the soft heat and drill the holes. So I'm taking the end cap off. You don't necessarily need to do this, but it's going to make wiring the baseboard a little bit easier. Unscrew the set screw and remove the spring clamp with a flathead screw. There. Now flip the soft heat over, remove the end cap, and unscrew the set screw that holds the wiring box cover on. Now that the wiring box is removed, go ahead and remove the knockout and you can feed the wire into the wiring compartment and install the strain relief connector to the wire. Put the rest of the strain relief on the end of the wires and tighten it down. Then screw the ring onto the strain relief fitting. Now you're actually ready to wire the heater. Attach the bare copper wire to the grain ground screw and tighten it clockwise. Take the white supply wire coming from the wall and attach it to one of the black wires in the heater. Now take the black supply wire coming from the wall and wire it to the remaining black wire coming from the heater. This Cadet Soft Heat is not polarity sensitive, so it doesn't matter which supply wire attaches to the black wires in the heater. Safely tuck all the wires into the wiring compartment and reattach the wiring box cover with the set screw. Now reattach the end plate with the screw and the spring clip. You may have to use a stubby screwdriver to get the screw installed. Now using the holes that you pre-drilled, attach the soft heat to the wall, making sure that you have solid contacts with the wall studs. Now just reattach the soft heat cover and you're done. Okay, our soft heat baseboard is now installed. We're gonna go ahead and turn the breaker on and get this thing up and running. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to give us a call here at Cadet Technical Support. I'm Thomas, thank you very much.